In this video, I'm going to show you how to edit texts in a PDF for free. Hi, my name is David, and if this is your first time checking out my content, kindly consider subscribing if you like what you see. Editing texts in a PDF can be a real hassle, and if you don't have the right tools for the job, it's going to be hard for you to edit your PDF and make any changes that you needed to make. Luckily for us, we have LibreOffice, which is almost an equivalent of Microsoft Office, but supports editing of PDF documents. LibreOffice is available for Windows, Mac OS, Linux, and also has LibreOffice for Android and iOS. Therefore, if you have a PDF file that you want to edit, you can use LibreOffice for free, even if you're using uh, whichever application or operating system that you're using. So LibreOffice comes in uh, with a couple of packages. We have Draw, we have Calc, we have Writer, uh, just to mention a few. And these are just like uh, Microsoft Word, uh, spreadsheets, uh, and uh, illustrations and all that. Uh, but here is the homepage of LibreOffice. It's free, and it's actually a very major uh, open source application. So we're going to use this to edit our PDF, and I already have the PDF uh, with me. Uh, here is the PDF that I have. Eight in-demand subtitling and captioning jobs that earn you good money, even if you're a beginner. If I just open this up. I want you to notice that there is an error uh, with uh, the second word captioning, it should be captioning uh, videos. So I want us to correct this particular word using LibreOffice uh, and in this uh, video LibreDraw. Now let's open up uh, LibreDraw. So let's go to all programs and then uh, check for the LibreSuite and I'm using LibreOffice 7.0. Just open that and then open LibreOffice Draw. Uh, and uh, it's good that we can do this using LibreOffice uh, because sometimes uh, you don't have the money to buy applications like Adobe uh, Acrobat DC. Uh, but when you have a free option available, utilize it to the maximum. We have a blank document uh, laid out for us. And what we need to do inside LibreDraw, all we need to do is just come to the file, click on open, and we navigate to the folder with the particular PDF we want to edit. This is the PDF we want to edit. And once I click on open, it's going to populate uh, on the canvas here. Uh, and the one thing that you'll notice if I zoom in slightly, you'll notice that it gives us this particular, uh, shows us it's a mistake. Uh, there's a mistake somewhere here. So if we look at it closely, let's uh, zoom in extra you'll notice that subtitling and captioning videos. Now, for you to edit this particular text, all you need to do is just click on it just once and you'll see the cursor flickering. So what you need to do is just move to where you want to start making the changes. And then we do a backspace. Captioning, videos, it's not an easy task. And if you're satisfied with the edits you've made, just click out. And you'll notice that subtitling and captioning videos is not an easy task. It takes roughly 8 to 20 minutes to manually caption one minute of video from a transcript. Now, if that was the only edit you were supposed to do, then you're done making the edits. Just come to File, Export as, Export as PDF. You can change anything that you want to change here. Uh, but for the purposes of this video, I'll just leave everything as it is. Click on export. And the only thing we may need to do here is maybe add uh, an edited uh, PDF uh, to the end so that we can know that this one has already been edited and click on save. Once we click on save, the file is going to save. And if we look at our folder, we now have two files. Uh, we have the edited and this one. If we close out this, and we don't want to save the file, let's close out. You'll notice that we now have two files. If I open the original one, this is the original one. It opens in Adobe Acrobat Pro. We have the error here. Our error is here, captioning. But if I open uh, the edited file, it's corrected. And that is how you can edit text in PDF for free. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you're interested in getting uh, LibreOffice, it's free. Uh, you can just come to the download options and just click on download LibreOffice. 
and it's going to give you uh, your your system settings uh, what make it is LibreOffice 7.0.1 and it is one of the best applications that you can ever use if you're on a budget and if you don't have Microsoft Office installed on your computer. Thank you for watching this video. If you got any value from this video, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel and like the video, share it with your friends, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.